guys welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm going to be doing a big target try on haul so this is like a collective haul so these are all things that i've picked up in the last like month and a half or so um and i just was kind of looking through my closet i'm like i have a lot of new target stuff that i haven't shared as always i will link everything down below for you guys along with my sizing and everything and let's jump right in all right guys this is the first look very simple this is actually what i'm wearing today and if you look really close you can probably see the yogurt stains that i already have on it and this is my first time wearing it so anyway this is by universal thread so i actually have the t-shirts that are very similar to this that i will also share in this try on um this is one of them here but the t-shirts have like kind of a scoop v-neck and these ones have a regular crew neck so it's just so soft and comfortable it's the perfect everyday kind of like cotton jersey material um, and I love this ruffle shoulder it's subtle but the fact that this is really just like a t-shirt dress I love that and the length is really good too it's got these little slits in the side which I like just add a little detail at the bottom but it's just above my knee and I am 5'4 if you are more petite you could belt this just to bring it up a little bit but also I think if you're taller this would be totally um, fine I mean you have quite a bit of leeway there with the length because it is a little bit longer um, than I know a lot of t-shirt dresses can be so yeah I think this is a really good one it came in um, a few different colors yeah I absolutely love this I just picked it up and I can see myself wearing this all the time so with this I paired my a new day sandals so funny story about these sandals guys I have repurchased these three times now. Oh, the first time I repurchased them, I just needed a new pair. I had worn them like two or three summers in a row. I think it was two summers in a row. I was on my third summer and I needed to repurchase them. So that was last year. So I bought brand new ones. And then Braxton just recently chewed them. And I was so bummed out, but so thankful that they came back with them again this year. These have literally been a repeat style for years now and I can see why they also have them in nude I believe which is um, the color I had originally gotten but now I'm addicted to the black as well so and I do find that they are true to size I just feel like they kind of dress up yet almost like edge up any outfit they kind of look like rocker in the black if the rocker vibes kind of not your style um, definitely check out the nude ones or the other color options they may have two other color options I can't remember but yeah simple easy outfit this is so me I wear this multiple times a week. Okay, so those of you guys who follow me on Instagram, you may have already seen these pieces because I do mention them pretty often. They're favorites of mine. So these shorts are 15 bucks and this top is like $12.99 or something. So affordable. But this is the ruffle top that's very similar to the last dress that I showed you guys, which by the way, that dress was in an extra small. Everything um, in this try-on is in an extra small. And then my shorts are in a double zero. Anyway, this is such a casual and comfy look. Um, I did throw on my Steve Madden studded sandals, but everything else is from Target. Yeah, I just really love this top. I love the neckline. It's like a subtle, it's almost like a V, but it's just like a really low scoop. And I think that's really flattering. I love the color of this. I also have this. It's in like an olive -y kind of brown, burnt olive color, but I love that and I wear it all of the time. So I had to get the cream. They also have like an ombre cream to like light blue one that's really cute if you're kind of more into color and then these shorts I also have these in white but they're super distressed on the bottom they're kind of a little bit like looser in through here which I like it's just kind of adds to like the style um, they fit me perfectly in the waist I love the distressing and then I also love that in the back they kind of like scoop down so they're actually not super short in the back I really appreciate that I like short shorts and I like them to be kind of like ripped and distressed, but I really don't need my cheeks hanging out. Like, it's just not the look I'm going for. So I really appreciate that these kind of scoop down low in the back, and I love them. I have heard a couple people say that these give them like diaper butt. Um, I don't know. For me, I don't experience that at all. Yeah, I don't know. I guess just based on your body type and whatnot. I don't know. I guess maybe they don't work for everybody, but I love them. They're 15 bucks. They're worth a shot if you order them and you don't like them you can always return them and then I just paired this look with this little bag that I found this is super cute I love this texture here and it's just small enough for like a little bit of money and a lip gloss and your phone good little side body bag but I liked that it had that like I said that texture on it but it's still very very neutral close up on the bag just so you guys can see it a little bit better but yeah it's really cute and it was inexpensive as well like this is the perfect kind of just like walking around the shops or something in the summer. This is like what I would wear, little weekend outfit, just running around with the kids. So absolutely love. Guys, same shorts and I just swapped out my top. I love this graphic tee. 
I think this is so fun. It's in this super soft, like thin material. And I loved this floral print going on in the graphic. I just haven't really seen that. So I thought this would just be a cute one to kind of throw on. Denim shorts, easy. And it's not like cropped, but it's definitely not long. It's, yeah, I guess it, I would say it is a little bit cropped, but it's not a crop top. It's not something that is necessarily going to show your, your belly or for most people, I don't think that it would. It's really good just to like front tuck. And I love that it's lightweight and so soft because then it just, just kind of hangs just right, if you know what I mean. Yeah, really cute. And then I just paired it with my... Steve Madden sandals. This is all you're going to see this whole haul. I love these shoes though and realistically like I wear them all the time. All right another super casual and comfy look. So these are the same shorts but in white and it's funny because these shorts have like a totally different hem. As you guys can tell they don't have that big like cutout that the denim ones had. These ones just kind of scoop up and then scoop down in the back. But again they're baggy here which like I said I just kind of and I kind of like and then I love this like fraying down at the bottom I think that's super cute and how they come up on the sides but yeah I think these are super cute a great length again $15 cannot beat that so they're worth a try and then on top I have this a new day ribbed um, crew neck tee this is so comfy so soft I absolutely love this I got this in black as well and I wear them all the time. Um, I have a lace bra on, so there's like kind of some weird texture going on, but that's just my bra. I just really like it. I like that the sleeves are a little bit longer because I almost feel like it makes the top look a little dressier, that they're like fitted and go halfway down like my bicep. Um, yeah, just a really good basic. It was like around $8 for the tops. And there is that look. Okay, so this is a look for those of you guys who may be lucky enough to be going to some like festivals or um, concerts or anything like that. I think this would be a really, really cute look. So I have the same white shorts on. I just paired it with this band tee, which I think is so cute. I've been wanting a band tee that's smaller. I feel like I order all of my band t-shirts in like a medium or a large so that I can wear them with my leggings. But lately I've been wanting to like tuck them in. So this one's perfect. I got it in an extra small and it's actually still like oversized. So you definitely could get your true size even just for like a little bit of an oversized look if you want to do a front tuck or something like that. It's a nice like cotton material. It's very thin so I think that's good for um, summer and I love the way it looks with these white shorts and then just for fun like I said for like a festival look or if you are able to like get out and do something fun I just think this is a uh, fun combo. So I paired it with these white boots which are from Walmart. Yeah, I really like this look. It's just a little bit different, not something that I would wear on like a daily basis necessarily, but also you could just swap out the boots for the Steve Madden sandals and then I would totally wear this every day. Super duper cute. Okay guys, this next top is super versatile and I feel like if you don't have a top like this, I don't know, I just kind of feel like everyone should have one just because you can do so many different things with it. So I just have it front tucked into those same white shorts. I think it looks really, really cute. It's very, very soft and comfortable. I have mine like super duper unbuttoned, but I love the way it looks with uh, like just some layered gold jewelry. It does have a collar here and it buttons all the way up. But I like the kind of wide sleeve and oversized fit of it. Like I said, it's very soft, very comfortable. They had this in a ton of different colors and prints, but you can wear this unbuttoned with like a tank underneath. You could tuck this into like a dress skirt or some high-waisted jeans. That would be really, really cute. Like some straight jeans and um, little like sandals. I will untuck it just so you guys can see like the length and everything. But yeah, it's just kind of like a classic length. It's definitely not like tunic length or anything. But yeah, I just think it's really, really good. It was very affordable. I think it was around $20 or so. Yeah, it was 18 bucks. So just where you can do so many different things with it. You can also unbutton the bottom and then like pull this up and you could tie it there too if you like the little tie in the front. Just a good basic top to have it. Although it kind of looks like a pajama shirt now that I have it untucked. I'm kind of into that too, I guess. <laughs> Okay, next look, I'm actually going to throw a blazer on over this in just a second, I think. But this is just really, really comfy. It's just a plain tank and then these linen shorts that are super cute and very, very comfy. This tank kind of looks like sporty to me. I think it's the neckline and just like the fit, but it's really, really soft and stretchy. I heard it with these linen shorts. So these are like little paper bag shorts. The tie is um, adjustable, which is great. So you can actually cinch it right in and they're super duper cute. They have these in a few different colors. Um, they do have some big pockets in the back um, and then they have these like long big pockets in the front too which is nice because you could actually I mean geez I'm, you could fit like almost an iPad in these things <laughs> but for real you really could fit your phone and like keys or whatever they might pull your shorts down but nice big pockets in the front okay I would say like I have other shorts that are kind of more flattering on my bum like from the side I kind of feel like they flatten me out a little bit just because of all the gathering here it's not showing like 
that part of my back that kind of goes in. Uh, but if you are looking for some shorts to maybe like tone down your booty, uh, these might be a good one. But anyway, with that said, I'm going to throw on that blazer I was talking about. I kind of, I mean, I imagined it with this, but maybe, maybe it won't be good. We'll try this. So this is a linen blazer. This, I want to say just the way it fits, it makes me think maybe I got a small instead of an extra small. No, it's an extra small. So it definitely has an oversized fit, which I like. I really like the fit of it. It just made me think maybe that it was um, a small instead of an extra small, but it's really good, very comfortable. Plenty of room in the sleeve too. Like sometimes um, I know that it can be tight up there and I don't think that even in your regular size that most people would have an issue with that. And I love this sage green color. I haven't really seen a blazer in this color this season. So I think it's just kind of fun to mix it up sometimes, do something a little bit different. And it is good to just have a good linen blazer in your closet. It's a good one if you're looking for a blazer like this. I can't get over how comfortable it is. Like, it's really, really comfy. Okay, jumping into the dresses. I have quite a few dresses to share with you guys. This one is the first one. This is by Universal Thread. And the reason I got this is because a couple months ago, I had actually picked up this same exact print um, in like a little jumper for L. So I grabbed this to match because I thought it was really cute. But I don't think I'm going to be able to keep it because I got an extra small and it is just like, I mean, it is really, really big. So I would definitely say like, can you guys see? It's just really, maybe it's supposed to be off the shoulder. I mean, I guess you could wear it that way. It just seems really, really big. I mean, the waist is all like, it's just, just too big. It's just a little frumpy on me. The length is really good though. If you are taller, this would be a really good um, length on you. Um, but I just feel like I'm absolutely swimming in this. I, it doesn't look as bad as it does um, in person, but yeah, other than that, the quality of the dress is really good. It's just not for me. I do love the puff sleeve and like the idea of the dress. If this were to fit you, I think it would be adorable. Definitely a size down in this one. It is for sure um, just too big. This is fitting like a small or a medium almost. So, okay, next up I have this long midi like t-shirt dress. This is in the softest material because it's so soft, so stretchy and comfy. It feels like pajama material. It's that soft and it is ribbed. I got mine in the white and black stripe variation, but they had this in a ton of colors, um, including some plain colors as well. I love this slit on the side. So yeah, if you're looking for something more fitted and um, just like casual. I think this is such a great option. Guys, don't you think with a denim jacket and just like these little sandals? Adorable. You could also pull this up and tie it on one side. That would be really cute too. Kind of create like an asymmetrical hem in the front, but really good. Okay, another t-shirt dress, but one if you want more of like a looser fit. This is something that I would wear all of the time. Um, you could also belt it if you wanted to kind of bring it in a little bit, but I think it's got really nice length to it. It's not long. It's not short. Very, very comfortable. It's like perfectly oversized and I think it looks really cute with like a denim jacket over it or you could even um, like knot up the bottom a little if you want to give it just a little more detail, but I got mine in this really light um, like tie-dye kind of variation, but they had it in a ton of different colors and options and it's a really soft kind of like not thick cotton but it is like a little bit thicker it's not like a really kind of like thin jersey material it's got a little bit more structure to it if that makes sense and this was I believe $12 I cannot believe that I think that's such a good deal and I just really like the fit and the way it looks and everything it's a really really good one so uh, I have it paired with my Steve Madden sandals which I think this is just like a really easy look and if you tied something again around your waist like a little denim uh, button up or something right around your waist I think that would be super cute and just kind of like complete the look and make it look a little more styled I'm telling you guys I'm all about the t-shirts and t-shirt dresses and whatnot so here's another one uh, this is another good one if you want more of like that midi length but you want something looser so this is by Universal Thread I'm just obsessed with the fabrics they use. So comfortable. I love the slit on the side. Got this one in an extra small. They have them in a ton of colors. They also have this really pretty, it's like burgundy and kind of like burnt orange tie-dye one that I've had my eye on for a while. I may end up getting that one, but I just went with the classic black with the little tie-dye stripes. Thought it was cute, easy. Denim jacket, sneakers, sandals, like truly like a perfect staple to have. It also covers your arms more. So if this is kind of like a problem area for you, I highly recommend this one just because it does have that unique kind of like wide um, sleeve that comes out and it just really covers that like bra bulge that I know a lot of us kind of like struggle with depending on um, you know like what bra you're wearing and stuff so yeah I just like that it is very high coverage in the top and I have it paired with my sparkly little sandals that I showed you guys earlier 
very easy, cute, every day. All right, next up, this is actually one of my favorites. I've shared this one on Instagram a couple times now, but I just wear this all the time. I think this is so cute. It's in like that really nice, kind of like muslin, linen-y material, and it's pretty, like it's, I think it's got two layers to it, so it's a really nice weight, and it feels much more expensive than it is. I love the buttons down the front. The spaghetti straps are adjustable, so that's good, because you can obviously adjust it to what you like. It has pockets, which is just very functional and just kind of cute as well. And then I like that the buttons are functional too because number one, you can breastfeed in this. It's really easy to just like unbutton and, um, you know, let the girls out if you need to. But then it's also cute to unbutton the bottom and it creates like a little center slit in your skirt as well. Um, I don't know if you guys can see it's kind of hard with the black, but it is like a tiered skirt. So it's got some really nice volume here at the bottom. And somebody asked me if it bothers me that it doesn't go all the way to the floor. And absolutely not. I love that this is a trend right now to have it like above your ankle or that midi style because I can't wear like a full maxi dress on a daily basis because chasing after the kids, I just end up stepping all over it and it's just a hot mess. So I really love this length because I can still move around and, you know, do, do all the things without like stepping and ripping the bottom of my dress all up. And I also love that this one's like, it's not fitted up here, but it's just like flattering. I think it's because of the weight of the material and that double layer that it just hangs really nicely. They do have some unique colors. They have like a bright green and I want to say like a fuchsia maybe, um, or a fuchsia stripes or something in this dress. I'm waiting for them to come out with another solid, like a white cream, something like that. A brown would be really pretty. This next dress, guys, I was completely influenced to purchase. So so if you don't follow three chicks and a farmer, I think that's her Instagram handle. I'll put it down below. But um, if you don't follow her on Instagram, she is adorable. She's a mama of two. She has the best taste and just, she has like timeless, classic, um, very tasteful style. And we actually did a Target share together one week. And this was one of her shares and one of her favorites. And when I saw it on her, I'm like, I need that dress. I'm obsessed. So once again, Universal Thread, it's in that nice like muslin material that just feels really like sustainable and good on the body. I love how um, these ruffles kind of like stand up. They're not like huge, so I don't feel like big and wide on the top. They just have volume almost like upwards. I just feel really good in this dress. Like it's just a really good dress and it has pockets and then it's got the tear at the bottom with another ruffle all the way down at the ankle. So adorable. This comes in multiple colors. Um, I've been talking myself out of the black one and the only reason I'm talking myself out of it is because to breastfeed in this dress, it's a hot mess express. So I cannot justify having two right now. I absolutely love this. I think it's really, really good. Actually, you know what? I should have slipped on my dressy. I don't know why I still have my black shoes on. I think I could get away with wearing my little snake skin heels from Target with this. That could be kind of cute if you wanted to dress it up a little bit. They're like snake skin and then the heel is wooden. So cute and true to size and very comfortable for a heel. This would be really cute for any bridal occasions that you have too or guest of if you get it in another color. You would totally wear this to a wedding but then it's casual enough to wear after as well. So Okay, I totally look like I'm on vacation. I love this dress so much. So I did notice that in the store they had this dress in a couple different colors. It was the same exact style but they did use that kind of more muslin material um, for a couple of the colors. I think the black one was in the muslin material and then this one and the green one are in a linen material. So I don't know if they're listed differently online. I will make sure, I'll make a note down below if you need to be just kind of like aware of the fabric. Um, depending on what color you get, I'll, I'll leave it down below. But this one is in the ivory and it's in the linen material. It has a really nice lining on the inside too that I really appreciate. It's super soft and this just feels really, really nice. Like this dress feels really good. I love the rolled sleeve. It's got a really nice oversized kind of fit. I got mine again in an extra small. I love the length on it. I feel like this with some sneakers would be so cute, but I also love um, you know, just some sandals. And then I'll mention this bag in these sunnies too, but I don't know why I put this on. Okay, I'll hold it like that so you guys can see the dress a little bit better, but I mean seriously, it's just so cute, so basic, really good, and I'm so glad I got my hands on it because I feel like this one is probably going to sell out and hopefully not before I get this um, video live. I have this like paired with these sunglasses. I had to mention these because I'm obsessed. So they've got like the tortoise kind of shell um, frame, but I love how flat they are. Can you guys see? They're literally like flat. 
and they're quite oversized. They feel really sturdy too, which I um, am thankful for because I tend to be a little rough on my sunglasses, but yeah, I just absolutely love these. And then this bag I have gotten so many questions on because it was actually just in the background of my old Navy haul. And I got so many questions. People were DMing me like crazy on Instagram. Um, and I was having to send them the link. So I will absolutely link this down below for you guys. Just from Target. It's by, I believe it's by A New Day. Yeah, and it's really, really cute. They had a couple different colors. It's kind of like the perfect size. Like you could fit, okay, I'm going to I'm gonna say what I would put in here. Fit a diaper, a little pack of wipes, um, your phone, a lip gloss, a snack, and a water bottle. Like, good to go. Yeah, this is like the perfect little phone slot in the front, so I love it. And I like that it can be crossbody too, so this whole outfit has to be a fave of mine. Oh yeah, I forgot. I wanted to share this hat with you guys because this is like a flop. It's like in a floppy hat material, like a beach hat, but I like that it's small and it doesn't have a huge like brim. What is that called? Brim? I don't really know what it's called. I don't know, I thought this was really cute, even just like truly with your bathing suit at the beach or like by the pool. It's a good one just to like protect your face, but I also felt like I almost could wear it back like that, like you would, um, you know, like other hats. I don't know if I love it with my hair straight, but yeah, I just thought it was really quite cute and just kind of a nice hat to have. All right, guys, here she is. <laughs> You guys have been asking for her. She wasn't in my last try on haul, so I just went and woke her up so you could be in it. They missed you. Honestly, she needed to get up from her nap anyway, but um, I figured I would grab her for the end of this video. So her hair is all sticky because she had fruit with her lunch and she was rubbing it all through her hair. She's got a big bruise on her forehead because she <coughs> fell at the playground. Um, or at a friend's playground and then when she's sleepy like when she wakes up her eyes are like a bit swollen so I love you you're the best you're the best you got a boogie too I need to get yeah wow both of our hair mama we look crazy town I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I love you guys I'll see you in the next one bye boo <laughs> where are you going mama Hi. <laughs> 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 <laughs>